Alléluia, my people of God. Good evening, good afternoon, good morning. It depends on the place you are. Hallelujah. We bless God Almighty. God bless you all mightily, powerfully in the name of Jesus. We thank God, my people of God, for God to make us to sing this wonderful a precious day in our life. Hallelujah to the most high God. Father, we thank you. Lord, we exalt you. Lord, we magnify your name because you are the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. Lord, I worship you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, blessed Redeemer, my people of God. Before we start the word of God, please let's close our eyes. I pray in the name of Jesus. Amen. Almighty Father, King of glory, Lord of love, Father, Lord, I bless you. No, oh Lord, Lord, I'm here again to speak your word, oh Lord, to your people, oh Lord. Father, Lord, as we go to speak, may I not speak on my whole Holy Spirit of the Most High God. I disappear, Father, you appear. Speak heart of me, O Lord. Father, I know nothing at all. Teach me your word. May your voice be here, Holy Spirit. May they see that you are the one that is speaking to at me. May this word go far, O Lord, as I go to speak this message that you are giving to me, O Lord, Father, King of glory. May your name be glorified. And I cover everyone, I cover myself, I cover every soul that will listen to this message with the precious blood of Jesus. Thank you, precious Father. Thank you, righteous Father. Thank Thank you jesus in jesus precious name i pray with thanksgiving amen hallelujah my people of god god bless us in the name of jesus god we thank god and make us to see a day like this many slept they did not wake up if god almighty did not tap you did not tap me we will not be alive today we are living by his breath we are living by the breath of the most high god so those that are dying we are not better than them we are not richer than them, not because the Lord loves us more than them. No, it's by His grace, by His mercy that we are loved. So we need glory, the glory. When you wake up, say, Father, thank you. But see your family, your children, hallelujah to the most. High. Glorify His name. It's worthy to be glorified. It's wonderful. It's, it's love. Everything about it is perfect. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' precious name, I pray with thanksgiving. Amen. My people of God, I want to talk about love. Love is very important. In, in, in the body of Christ, in the church of God, we have to love each other. The word of God said so the greatest commandment is for us to love God and love each other, love one another. Love yourself, love your neighbor as you love yourself. The way you love yourself, also love others. So it's very important for us to walk in love because the Bible makes us to know that God himself is love. Hallelujah. It's love, and it's, it's, he loves us first before we love him. According to the book of First John, he is the one that loves us first before we love him. So any believer that are living, that want to serve the Lord, that want to make heaven, they, he must love, he must have that spirit of love, he must love one and other, he must love everybody, he must love humanity. So God love want everybody. You Christians, we believers, we need to love everybody. Whether the person is a believer, not a believer, we don't have right to it because the standard of God is love. So this love we are talking about is what we pray for because God himself is love. So as we are serving God, we we are knowing God. We need to ask God, Father, give me the spirit of love. Love is to, to open the realm of the spirit. It's wrong. Love is, is access to the power of God. When you love others, when you manifest the love, God will always use you powerfully. God don't use people anyhow. He look at the, your, your motive. Who are you? Who is this person? He shakes his heart. So the, number one way to, to attract the power of God, to be used by God, is by love. You have to love, love. You have to love others. You have to be one of other bodies. You have to be careful. You have to be caring. I mean, you have to be caring. You have to love, to be kind, to be good. The fruit of the spirit must manifest in you. You have to love. And I pray that God will give us the spirit of love in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's go to the Bible of God. According to First Corinthians chapter 13, verse 4. Let's read what the word of God says about love. Verse 4 says, so charity suffer long hallelujah charity is suffer long which is charity anyone that love that means charity means love anyone that love is must be patient we say soft is suffer long that is it you must be patient no matter what you are passing through no matter what you the situation or the pattern that living or the your marriage or whatsoever you are living because you love you have to be patient he said charity is suffering long which is me love is patience you have to be patient and it's kind. Hallelujah. Anybody that says that it's blood, you must be kind. If you say that you, you, are, you are a person that loves, you must add the spirit of patience. Hallelujah. You must be patient and you must be kind. Hallelujah. So the word of God, you say, and it's kind. So you say you love, 
my people of God, brothers and sisters, you have to be kind. And you have to be patient if you want to know. If you want to check yourself, I don't want to, I want to know whether I'm a person that I love. Have the one of our one have the spirit of patience, which is long suffering, long, long suffering, the spirit of patience and kindness. That is how you know whether you are a person that have the spirit of love. Hallelujah. It says charity every not at all. Anybody that have uh, love, it don't it don't it don't have you not, it don't jealous. No, what no. What? No, you don't have that spirit of jealous. It's a charity envy. No, you don't need to envy on any other, anyone or other. You have to, to do, do, that spirit of envy or jealous yeah, will be far from you. Person that love don't envy. Charity violated no itself. Yes, charity violated no itself. Charity, a, a person that love did not pride. He did not pride of himself. Don't look at himself, myself, myself. No. So a person that is pride, like a person that is love, don't have a spirit of pride. And it's no proof of verse 5. Say, so, do not behave in self on sin. Sin, uh, sin. Seeking not their own. It is not easy to provoke thinking not evil. Verse 6, the last verse says, we just not iniquity, but we just in truth. Hallelujah. So I'm just talking about love. So it means this whole Bible verse makes us to know that it says love does not boast. Anybody that has spirit of love does not boast. Anybody that has the spirit of love does not pride. Anybody that has the spirit of love must be patient. Anybody that has the spirit of love, it must, it must, it must do things good, good. It must, it must please God. It must not be easily angry at all. If you have the spirit of love, it must not be easily angry. No, it must not be easily provoking. You understand? And that person that has the spirit of it, don't go keep record of wrong things. You don't keep record of wrong things. What people are doing, you be thinking, no, the spirit of love, you don't, don't have all those the record of wrong things, what people have done for you, done to you in the past. No, no, the spirit of love does have those things. The spirit of love does not boast. The spirit of love does not dishonor others. The spirit of love respects. If you have the spirit of love, don't dishonor others. You have to respect others. You have to live the way that we please God. So I'm talking about love. Please let's love. Check yourself. Are you a lovely person? Are you a patient person? Are you a kind person? Are you a caring person? Are you the person that does seek uh, self uh, self seeking self righteousness? Are you are you discerning other? Are you so are you quickly uh, quickly angry? So much you just be boasting, little things you'll be angry, provoking. Are you a person like that? If you're a person like that, you don't have the spirit of love. If you're a person like that that record what people have done in the past, you have been taking it. Ah, this is what this sister have done to me. This is what my husband have done. Oh, so so and so person have done. You will remember him. You don't have the spirit of love. The Bible says, Love your enemy. Jesus said, Love your enemy. The word of God says, Love your enemy. You must love. You must love. No need to keep us. that person. No, 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 no. That, 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 no. Human being cannot die. We are not fighting against flesh and blood. You don't need to mention the person. It's my sister that is uh, affecting me. That, no. God don't answer prayer because Jesus Christ came to. He said, I care for the sinner. I care for the sinner, not the righteous. So the person that, the Lord don't mention that I care for the sinner. Are you telling to kill sister, your sister, your brother? No. He said, Love your enemy. Pray for them. Pray for them. God know how to handle them. You know those are your enemy. I don't know my enemy. No one is element hallelujah nobody knows it's element let's love let's pray for each other let it as see those that refuse to repair god know how to handle them he's the almighty god he's the one that created them so i'm talking about love let's love let's love let's do this with one man let's be unity in christ one accord love is very important in the body of christ when you love you will be free hallelujah and i pray may the lord give us the spirit of love today in the name of jesus god bless you all my people of god this is the message for us God love us so much. Love one another. Let's love. Let's love each other. And love God powerfully. I pray that God will give us the spirit of love in the name of Jesus. Christ. God bless you. Huh? I thank God for this message. And I cover this world into our heart in the name of Jesus Christ. The devil will not steal it away from us in Jesus' name. God bless you all in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Daddy. Bye-bye, my people of God. God bless you all. Thank you.